Hey Pack, what's going on? My name is NerdWolf, welcome back to Undertale. The last episode of Final Spider, it was hard. Hey look, Donald Trump, let's go. <laughs> I fought Muppet, Muffet, I fought Muffet. I've fought her like eight times now, and I've died every time, and I hate donuts. You'll see what I mean if this is a successful one. If not, this will go in the grand compilation of me losing to a freaking spider lady. <laughs> Alright, I got this. You know what? You know what? I do hate spiders. Screw you guys. Oh, God. Don't look so blue, my dearie. Oh, is that a pun on how you're making me purple? It's not because you're making me purple and not blue. I think purple's a better blah, 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 blah. Well, whatever you... Well, screw you and... And... Yeah. All the spiders, all the spiders, clap along to the music. It's not hard because the music's really catchy. Oh boy. Brad, you're gonna make a delicious cake. Yes, I am so delicious. Wow, this is really slow compared to later in the fight. If I get hit now, basically screw me the whole way through. Because if I can die on this part, then I can basically just go home, call it quits, throw in the cap. I don't even wear a cap. This is the problem with human society. Spider society, they just throw donuts at people and that's just fine. That's just fine with everybody. Oh, now there's a cupcake involved. You know what? I'm not even gonna pay, because I've never gotten hit at this cupcake. You wanna know why? Because it's so freaking easy to fight and I don't have enough syllables. Hey, look, a cupcake. Oh no, I'm scared. You just gotta dodge the freaking spiders and the spiders is what will get you. But you want to know why? Because they sell the freaking donuts. And by sell, I mean throw at people. All well, spiders clap along to that music. Oh, spiders and donuts. That's exactly what I wanted in my dream. This is what I dream about, guys. It's not even a dream. It's a nightmare. I have nightmares about this. Well, I would if I went to sleep, but I don't because I fight spider donuts. I fight spider donuts for a living. <coughs> Ugh. Jesus. Huh. <sighs> No? How about no? How about no? Huh. And a singular boomerang, which indicates the next thing I'm gonna fight, which, gee, I wonder what it's gonna be. Oh, is that a boomerang? I never would've guessed because, oh my god, am I as Australian? What? Uh, I would do an Australian accent, but I'm kinda- Oh, another cupcake. That's fan freaking tastic I didn't even pay. I didn't even pay, and I got hit. I got hit, and I didn't even pay. This is the. This is what's wrong with me. I don't think through my decisions, and then I die. I die because I don't think through my stupid decisions. Now the spiders are fast, and I'm gonna die, and it's not gonna be easy. Or maybe I'm gonna make it through this, but I shouldn't say that because then I'm not going to make it through this. Oh, I did it. I made it through it. That's fine. That's fine. Now, um, now I can save my money, and then I can go buy some, um. Um, something that will make me happy. I don't, I don't know. Who wants to go freaking donuts? Let's go ahead and pay you for donuts, because I always get hit by the donuts. You see, I already got hit. I got hit by the donuts. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad I paid for this. It's 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 a free service to get thrown uh, donuts at. You know, you can pay us. You can pay us. We're uh, we're still gonna throw donuts at you, but they won't be as hard. Don't worry about it. I am not worried about it because now you're throwing boomerangs like a freaking wimp. What's he? What it? What are you even? What are you even gonna do? No, 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 no. Oh, finally! Oh man, I've gotten good! I've gotten good, son! What do you even think? What do you even think I'm, I'm gonna... Oh, jeez. What do you even think you're gonna do with how good I'm playing? 16 health? Wow! Usually, I'm at 1 health by now. But you know what? I've just gotten so good, it's like, oh jeez. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez! Alright, that's... That's fine. I've just gotta dodge a little bit, you know? It's just... Undertale's about dodging. They don't want you to fight. Fighting's for bad people. I'm not a bad person. I just accidentally killed Goat Mom. You're still alive? Yeah, I'm still alive! I've never made it to this part! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my god, it looks like it's time for dessert. Huh? A telegram for spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying that they saw you and you helped donate to their cause? This has all been a big misunderstanding. They thought you were someone that hated spiders. A person who's asked for that soul. You must have met a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble, human. I will make it up to you. You can come here anytime for your like. And no charge. And I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll spare you now. Muffet is sparing you. 
Oh my god! Oh my god! That was the most intense five minutes of my life! I'm never getting that back! Well, it's been more like an hour with fighting Muffet. Look, I can walk right through these spider things now. Oh, jeez. <sighs> I'm gonna need a minute. <laughs> I'm gonna pop a freaking vein. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> a tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate. It looks like it's almost time for the divorce. I gotta go see that play. It's gonna be beautiful. Whoa, that, that's kinda cool. I like the background. Oh, that human. <laughs> it's Metaton. You know what? I'm kinda glad you're here. Could be. My one true love. Someone help me process this. I can't. I can't process this. Uh, how can Metaton process this? <laughs> you know what? <sighs> Dog marriage. A lesbian scientist. Spiders! Monster King! Forbids your stay! Humans must! Live far apart! Even if it breaks my heart, they'll be put you in the dungeon! Yeah, it'll suck, and then you'll die a lot. <laughs> I've already died a lot. Really sad. You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. <laughs> so sad it's happening. A wishing star. So sad. So sad you are going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. <coughs> oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh crap, I have to remember how this works! Oh jeez. Oh heavens have mercy, a horribly colored tile maze. Each color tile has its own sadistic function. For example... Wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right. You remember all the rules, don't you? Great. I won't waste your time repeating them. Oh, and you better hurry, because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. <laughs> Good luck, darling. You know what? I've got this. I've got this. Pink are fine, right? Red is lava. Green has you smell like... No, no, no. Blue, and then green, and then orange. Yes! I smell like oranges. If I go into blue, that's fine. That clears up that. And if I go into orange, yeah, that's fine again. But I smell like oranges, so I can't go in blue. I gotta go back into green, and then I can pass through purple. Right. Now I smell like lemons? Nah. They don't like lemons. I'm so sorry, it looks like you're out of time. Yeah, there was nowhere for me to go. Here come the flames, darling. They're closing in. Getting closer, oh my! Any minute now! Please shut off. Please, Alphys, shut them off. <laughs> Watch out, I'll save you! I'm hacking into the firewall. Right now! Oh no, how could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. That's right, that's right! Come on, Metaton, give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us, not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over, now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle, over. Alphys, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make, they make a sound, then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. Metaton attacks. <laughs> Hey, it's Alpha's, it's my phone. You better answer it. 
Hey, hey, this is bad, but don't worry, there's one last thing they installed on your phone. See that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it. Phone's act menu is glowing. How would I... how would I... Yellow. Press the yellow button and the phone is resonating with Metaton's present. This is it, darling, say goodbye. What? Now press Z! I don't want to kill him, though. Oh. Oh. You've defeated me. How can this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc. Bye-bye. Looks like you beat him. You really did a great job out there. All thanks to you. What? Oh, no. I mean, you weren't the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Um, hey, this might strike you as strange. Can I tell you something? Before I met you, I didn't really, I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw-up. Like I couldn't talk very well. Or do anything without, without ending up letting everyone down. But, guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So, thanks for letting me help you. Um, anyway, we're almost to the core. I'll, it's just past MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. <laughs> I wonder if this would have actually been, like, possible to get through. I highly doubt it, because... I had 30 seconds, and I don't even think it's possible to walk past that 30 seconds. Is this these guys? Oh, uh, oh, hey. We're, like, taking a rain check on that whole killing you thing. Like, don't tell Undyne about this, okay? Aw, they're both happy together. I'm gonna get some freaking nice cream. The business is excellent here. These two fellas, fellas bought all my ice cream. Actually, blah blah blah. Wait, I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? Yeah, this is great. Thanks. Ooh, Sands. Wait, this paper. Hey, go up the creepy alleyway on the right for great deals. I might do that. Hey, I heard you're going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Uh, hell yeah. Great, thanks for treating... <laughs> Sands! <laughs> Over here, I know a shortcut. Sans, you and your shortcuts. Well, here we are. So, your journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but oh. Though, maybe sometimes it's just better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? Does Sans like me? Ah, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Sands! Hey, let me tell you a story. So I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Unfortun fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. And it's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out, like usual. I knock on the door and say knock-knock, and suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So, naturally, I respond, Dishes. Dishes who? Dishes a very bad joke. <laughs> then she just howls with laughter, like me! Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I keep them coming and she keeps laughing. <gasps> oh! That's what happened! He was telling Toriel knock-knock jokes and she was writing them down in her diary! That's so sweet! She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. <laughs> oh, wow. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus. No, papyrus. Bleh. Gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. But she told me to come by again, and so I did. Then I did again, and again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door, it rules. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up, then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them? 
Will you not? Now I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. I feel the same way, Sans! Do you get what I'm saying? I get what you're putting down. That promise I made to her? You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy. You'd be dead where you stand. What? What? Sans? Hey, lighten up, bucko. Just joking with you. I don't think you are! Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Yes, I have. Hey, what's that smoke supposed to mean? Am I wrong? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Because someone really cares about you. Oh no! I killed her! I'm so sorry! Oh, that sucks, man! Oh, jeez! Oh, Oh, this game's really putting the nail in the coffin of how I'm supposed to feel bad for that! <laughs> Alright. Thank you for joining me in this episode of Undertale. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!